this afternoon the Cincinnati Reds seek a sweep of the first place Texas Rangers. This will be a tough day for Graham Ashcraft to pitch emotionally. On Monday his grandmother passed away in Texas one month shy of her 83rd birthday. Graham decided to stay and pitch today and then fly out to be with his family after the game because that's what grandma would have wanted him to do. India a perfect start the opening inning one two three Gray has pitched very well at a very good spring and he's carried that over here into the regular season today making his fifth start oh two and this one lined softly to third caught down there by Young nice reach heading toward the line he takes one away from steer and the inning is done to Indolis batting 258 on the season seven homers and 28 RBIs one two pitch this one up the middle that's a base hit for Garcia Indolis is on first base runner of the ball game for either team Ooh. Boy inside and that is ball four so a single a hit batter and a walk great start to the second inning the Rangers have the bases loaded Grossman skies a pop up on the infield right side Jonathan India waiting on it makes the catch the runners hold and that is a huge first out three pitch K really nice job by Graham Ashcraft right there there's two men gone here in the second bases loaded payoff grounded right side Ashcraft has to cover shovel from steer he hit the bag and they got it and he just does get to the bag for the out and the inning is over. The Rangers load the bases with nobody out and do not score. Stevenson had a couple of hits last night going two for four scored a run and he clocks that ball to left base hit Stevenson turns Grossman gathers standing double and Stevenson's been on base in 15 consecutive games Tyler Stevenson that's what he does right, So Jake Fraley the batter and he hits this ball hard. Out to right field, back to the wall, and a catch out there against the fence by Jankowski. Boy, had some ground to cover. He's got great speed, but then he had to take on that wall, and that's a heck of a play. One away. So one gone, and now Henry Ramos. One out in the pitch to Ramos. He swings, sends a high fly ball left center field. Jankowski on the run again. And Jankowski misses it. Stevenson breaks. Windmill on the third. He rounds and roars home. Over to third. Ramos head for slide. Stevenson scores a triple for Ramos and a one nothing Reds lead. It's an RBI triple and the Reds are up one to nothing. Now Kevin Newman bats. The Rangers have the infield in. Grounded. Picked by Young. Throw to the plate. They need a tag. Ball free. Ramos scores. Newman's on and it's two nothing. That was a gamble of a throw. It was a low throw. Jonah Heim tried to scoop it. But instead just kind of swatted the ball off toward the Rangers third base dugout and Ramos able to slide in easily. Ashcraft facing Marcus Simeon hard ground ball to third nice backhand Senzel long throw from the outfield grass on a skip it's there. He fell out of his keister as he uncorked that throw. Yeah nice job by Nick Senzel. Jake Fraley hit the ball well but lined out to center that was when Jankowski slammed into the wall 1-0. Tapped. Heim shovel. No. Fraley through the bag. Infield hit. Stevenson up to second. Here's the 1 1. And there's a soft ground ball headed for short on two hops. Skip towards Smith. The second one. Simeon to first in time double play. And the Reds are going to challenge. Did Ramos get there? The ball arriving at the glove seemingly simultaneously as Ramos's cleat hits the bag. The call on the field is overturned. The runner is safe. Cincinnati will retain their talent. So at the corners with two outs, Gray a long hold. Now the 0-2 pitch. Newman grounds it to short. Backhand pick up Smith. Long throw in time. The first to get Newman side retired. So that brings up uh, Leody Tavares. The 2-0 is a line drive into left field, and that falls for the base hit. Simeon stops at second, so the Rangers get their second hit. So runners at first and second. All right, so now low. And he shoots one into left. That stays fair. It's a base hit. Simeon is in. Tavares steaming into third, but they'll stop him on the double by low. It's two to one. Now they gave the Rangers a couple of opportunities, and now they have finally cashed in at least one. Tremendous opportunity now with Adolis Garcia coming up. Here's a 3-2 in the air, right field. 
Ramos going back. He has room to make the catch and does. But Tavares able to tag. He'll score without a throw. And the sack fly by Garcia ties the game. Here's Kurt Casale now, who was hit by a pitch his first time up. Kurt Casale shows bunt, drops it third base side. And it's Gray who picks it up and throws to first. He'll sacrifice for Casale. It moves Sinzel to second base. Runner off. Great jump. Pitch missed down. Throw to third. Safe. Sinzel swipes third. Sinzel runs the pitch. A ball. Throw to third. Not in time. Stolen base. Sinzel, his second. And the Reds have him at the corners with one out for TJ Friedel. 1 1. Left field. Grossman the glove. Senzel tags. Throw to the plate. Senzel is in. Sack fly RBI. Reds lead 3 2. The 1 2. And did he get him? Yes, he did. Steer couldn't stop himself, and that is strikeout number 1,000 for John Gray, and it gets him out of the inning. He becomes the 41st active major league pitcher with at least 1,000 career strikeouts. He gets a hug from Jonah Heim. Season high 100 pitches for Ashcraft. He'd love to see him get through six. The pitch. Miller, weak tapper, back to the mound. Ashcraft has it, and he will run and tag out Miller. On his way to the bag for the final out. So he does just that. Graham Ashcraft gets through six, allows just the two runs. Right, here we go to the top of the ninth inning. Ian Jabot remains in. And here's a liner toward the right field corner. Diving is Ramos. He can't get it. It's by him. It goes all the way to the wall. Heim around first, headed to second. He'll get there with a stand up double. And the Rangers have a potential tying run on in leadoff fashion to begin the ninth inning. And so now the corners are in and the pitch to Grossman. He shoots this one through left side. Thompson got a late start. He's to third and they'll stop him. Double and a single. And the Rangers have set up shop in the ninth inning. And here comes manager David Bell. And Jabot hands the ball off. Lucas Sims will get the call. Miller has faced him before. One for three against him with a home run. The 2 1. And that ball slugged high in the air center field should be deep enough. Friedel underneath it. Tagging at third Bubba Thompson. He'll score without a throw. And the sack fly by Miller has tied the game in the ninth inning. Newman 0 for 3 today. Fielder's choice is first time up. First pitch. Sharp ground ball. Backhand Smith from his keister. Bounces by. Newman loses the helmet wide turn. He races for second and first plunge. And the potential winning run in scoring position. So Newman awarded second. And the Reds have their leadoff man on in scoring position. And Nick Sinzel has looked pretty good at the plate over the last couple of ball games. And Sinzel launches one high and deep to left field. Back goes Thompson, looks up. It is gone! The homerless drought is over on a walk-off two-run home run from Nick Senzel, and the Reds walk off with a sweep over the Rangers. The Reds' longest power drought in three decades concludes in the most dramatic of fashions. The first walk-off bomb for the Reds since Nick Castellanos in September of 21. It holds their longest home run drought period since 1992, and the Reds win it 5-3.